Yeah, we're here. <laughs> hey, everyone, it's Agent Elrond. And this is Rafi McMutton Jumper. No, you, we, we are having our sexy voices today. You, are must we? Get, you must get your sexy voice on. All right, this is Rafi okay. McMutton Jumper. This is Agent Elrond. Welcome to this, this special kid friendly edition of Rondi Plays Fire Emblem 10 Radiant Dawn. Let's go. No swearing? No swearing. Oh, man. We're gonna try to make it through. Yeah. Oh! Bugger nuts. Oh. Shiitake, mush it. shiitake mushrooms. We're gonna try God to make it rage. <laughs> We're gonna try to make it through one episode without swearing. We used to do it, remember? Yes. We did, we did all of Fire Emblem 8 with only one F bomb. With only one F cluster bomb, though there were a few B words and SH words scattered about. H E double hockey sticks. Um, yeah. And we're yeah. back. We did a little bit of shopping. Uh, where, where is there? She, yeah, there we go. Yeah, Jill. There's there, Jill. Jill. I did the thing. We got her with a iron axe. Iron axe. Finally. We bought Tarneo a bronze lance. Um, even In though he he needs to poke something. Yeah, we didn't want to use up his um, nice. silver lance. Beautiful uh, silver lance. He's set up. Edward, you're set up. Edward took Meg's uh, iron sword because Meg basically, for accuracy, she's got her pinky, and for anything else, she can the use the steel sword just fine. When so, we don't um, feel like spamming the pinky. Volo! Yay, puppy! Um, yeah, I wanted to talk a little bit about Zhark. Might as well talk a little about Zhark and Edward here. They are both the, of the Swordmaster line. Uh, Zhark has a bit of a head start on Edward, and like I said, it, you, you level up Edward to level 20 and promote him, he's gonna basically look kind of like Zhark with maybe a little bit more strength and luck and, and health and health and, and maybe less a little resistance. Less, a little less like skill speed and yeah. Skill. Yeah, well, level one, he's gonna he he can't have as good speed as Zhark. Yeah. But Zhark Zhark beats him hands down in the resistance category. Let's just say that. <laughs> yeah. Um, Zhark is also good. Uh, he's also he's one of the the he is he is. He is endgame material. There's three, possibly four, swordmasters who are endgame material. Two of them are Zhark and Edward. And like I said, I, in my book, Zhark has an edge over Edward just because he's got a free adept. Instead of a free wrath. Instead of a because free wrath. Because adept is a godly ability yes, skill it is. thing. Um, so what I'm going to be doing in this playthrough, sorry Edward fans, I am going to be training Edward up and promoting him, so you will be able to see Swordmaster Edward. But after that, I'm actually going to switch and start training Zhark. Because I really dug him in Path of Radiance, but as you all know, I trained Mia instead. So this time around, you're going to be seeing me use Zhark a lot. And uh, I will be using him a little bit in part one, tactically. He's a good kind of striker kind of unit, but you don't want to use him too much. He's not a good chip down unit. He is not a good chip down unit. He'll destroy his, stuff. His, his high crit rate and his adept means that it's really, 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 really hard to get him to chip things down unless you buy him a bronze, a bronze sword. sword. But I'm not because I'm cheap. I'm saving my monies to buy something else. I want to go here. No, I don't want your. I stole an. Ah, yes, javelin. Yes, please. Yes, yes, yes. I will have that. Uh, let's send it to storage. Uh, and the, hand axe. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Uh, I don't think we. Let's see, you've got uses in your hand axe. Well, you, yeah, send it to storage. All right. Card, don't need the card. I haven't even you had so used his card at all. Um, oh, something else I should show. In no, not you. The armory. You can now buy steel weapons, which is nice. I believe you can buy steel weapons from here on until the end of this part, which is nifty. You can also I buy the, the L tones. The L tones, which I don't need. L light is completely outstripped. I'll just show you. L light is completely outstripped by. Thony. Just totally. Thony. If you have a Thony, don't you don't bother putting L light on Micaiah. <sighs> Let's look at some conversations. Oh go outside the village. Yes, that's what I had! Was that light? And that silver Could she Yeah, could she be the silverhead maiden? Hello? Oh it is! It is you! Oh, oh my! You're fighting with King Ashnod's son, the free day, aren't you? Oh, we've heard so much about you! Oh, what a blessing! What a blessing! We're 
all waiting for, waiting for the day you'll free us from those filthy banyan pigs. P please, take this. It's not much, but the people from all over the village pitched in. Oh, oh nein, I, I couldn't possibly. Thank you. We appreciate your kindness. We are all counting on you. Please, free us. Uh. Looks like Izuka's propaganda is working fast. Mm. You didn't want me to take the money, did you? It's not that. It's just... Oh, never mind. Oh, come on. What did I do this time? You're not going to say? Great. In that case, let's go get out of here and go find the others. Bickering. Kurt. What's up with... What are you doing talking to her? So, you're staying then? I appreciate your concern. However, I... You can't leave Prince Paris' side, is that not so? That's right. Then take this, at least. A sending stone. Do you remember how to use one? Of course, I remember how to use one. But it's such a precious gift. Are you sure about this? Arigato, Kurt. Kurt, where are you? I have no idea who that was. I must go now. Please, remain safe. You as well. Kurt? Mikhaya-san, how nice to, to see you. Kurt, I'm leaving... Oh, oops, I'm, I'm leaving for Terran. I know this is sudden. To tell the truth, I'm surprised too. I see. You are off to perform your first duties as general of this liberation army. Yeah. I abhor violence. I do not think you should fight. Curse! I'm not fighting because I enjoy- I know. I know you wish there were another way. And I understand that you feel this is what you must do to save your country. Mm. Here, take this. What is it? May it serve to protect you, Micaiah. I must leave you now. I'm going home to my own country. What? So suddenly? I'm sorry, Micaiah. Being so close to battle frightens me, to tell the truth. Thank you for rescuing me, and thank you for the short time we spent together. I enjoyed it immensely. Will I ever see you again? Who knows? Why don't we... Yes. Let us just leave it up to the goddess. I suppose we must. A renewal scroll. Nice skill. Thank you, Kurth. This... Something tells me I will see him again. Shall we talk about the renewal scroll? Yes, let's talk about some skills. Um, oh, where is... There you are, Bullet. This is the renewal scroll skill. It restores 10% of total HP each turn, and because it has a cost of 15, you can only put it on tier 2 units or Volug. Or Micaiah. Or Micaiah, because Micaiah is a freak. But we're not putting like it. That. Micaiah has an extra 5 points to her skill capacity as a tier 1 unit. Just, you know. Which I think is just so that you can put Paragon, her, uh, Paragon on her later. We are going to put it on Volug. Because he has the highest HP he can make to really make the most use out of it. And also because he tends to take a lot of damage. He's not a very good avoidance tank yet. Um, so we're going to do that. Over here, we're going to leave Discipline on Aaron a little bit longer, I think, for now. I guess. That, that um, you're good. Ah, yes, we want to take that off you. I wanted to be able to do this in Ra Path of Radiance so bad. See, this is the pro- See, Jill, Jill can't, like, put anything on her. <laughs> uh, we'll keep that Adapt on Zhark, of course. You're good with your cancel stuff. And Micaiah? We are going to turn Micaiah into a monster! Oh, by so the way, the description is misleading. In this game, it still works at uh, below half health. Oh yes, it, that's a typo. It it, it 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 hits in at half health. Resolve has also been kind of watered down, just like Wrath. It it, it kicks in at half health, but it only boosts your skill and speed. It doesn't boost boost strength anymore, which is why it's not really a loss to put it on Micaiah. The thing about putting Resolve on Micaiah is that you can have danger, Kaya. The thing about Resolve, of course, is that. 
you know, you have to have the unit run around at half health, which is kind of dangerous for a brawly unit because you're running around at half health and, you know, the boat boost to speed does make you harder to hit, but it doesn't make you impossible to hit. The thing about Micaiah is that she can always attack from a place of safety because she can attack at range. Also, because of sacrifice, she has a guaranteed, perfectly safe, non-lethal way of getting herself into resolve range. Yes. This combo, you could have Danger Kaya or Breath Kaya. I prefer Danger Kaya because she's a bit more reliable and you don't have to hurt her as much. Um, so I say as long as you're using Eddie, leave Wrath on Eddie. He makes pretty good use of it. It'd be interesting to pull it off and put it on Z-Hark, though. Of course, that would mean we have to get Z-Hark down to, you know, 10 health, but... Which would be hard, because he likes to dodge things, and at this point and, in the game, that 13... just break out Adept and destroy someone. Yeah. Anyway, uh, let's see, what else am I doing here? That's good. We can also award XP, but no one here has maxed anything yet, so we're not. No one here is, is at the point where they'd be gaining more stats to be XP than to normal level up. So yeah. So another thing you can do, uh, what you could do, is if you could find someone like with Lara here, um, you could give her like bring them up to the bring edge. Bring up to ninety, and then she could get like a regular. Uh, and you can you can sometimes you can do that if you want to you know sort of push people's levels up a little bit if they're falling behind. I am saving my BXB at this point um, for late or Let's look at supports. I want to mess around with some support some more. Uh, you're supporting Aaron. That's good. Um, you can... No. Ah, um, uh, yes. You support Leonardo. Very good. Um, no good. opportunity to boost. If you'll see a little up arrow next to the support rank, if you can... Yeah, I'm going to be messing about with supports. The Nolan Edward support, I'm actually going to be scrapping after this chapter, because Nolan has his new partner, Z-Hark. Yes, I am doing an Earth-on-Earth -Earth combo. They will be the avoidance tanks from hell. And Edward's eventually going to join up with Doggy here. But um, for now, I'm just going to leave that support on them to take advantage of it, those boosts while I can. Ah, let's save our progress. That didn't take very long. Shall no. we go on? Sure. Let's go on. Let's go. We're, uh... We're going off to save the day. Uh, let me just want to check items one last time. We're going off to raise the standard. We're going to raise the standard of this game. Raise the standards of our combat abilities and just start kicking ass even harder. The next chapter is a long one, so I'm just checking weapons here to make sure that, uh, yeah, I've got pretty good you Don't have to worry about something weapon. wearing out. Yeah, which would suck. <laughs> we, we're down to just Voloop chewing on things. <laughs> That'd be awkward. Yes, it would. A small troop of forces from the east. It appears to be the Dan Liberation Army. Blissfully ignorant of the trap that awaits them. I pity them too. I pity you! You guys never learn! Have the first platoon assume their battle positions. Away we go! Rah! Should we deploy too? Kind of you to offer, Lady Fiona. But the first platoon will suffice here. This is really none of Murata's business. I see. In that case, we'll use this opportunity to observe the Empire's army at work. I like her. I like her attitude. I like her attitude too. Maybe we can talk her into joining us. Mm-hmm. There's units! We can bring everyone! Woohoo! Uh, I am gonna have to plot a little bit here, guys, so I'm just gonna do some battle preparations and be right back. Uh, I think we're good. Okay. All right, we're back! I'll trust your judgment, Rondi. <laughs> I think we're good. All right, let's go! Person, new sorte music. Woohoo! And new battle music too. This is a oh, route map music. Map music. This is a route enemy map. It doesn't look like much right now. Not but, very technical looking. But just... it will get. It, this map has fun reinforcements. Let's just say that. Um. Yeah. Let's just say that. Mm. These guys hurt a lot. We'll throw Tarnail at them, bring them out, and then 
So this her. is a uh, tactical usage of Taraneo. All right, this guy. Watch out for this guy. It's fine. Just there will be fine. And yes, you just sit right next to Meg. Really exciting first turn, isn't it? Yeah, Jill, you and Meg, you and Meg, you are going to be the new bestest buddies. Yes, they are. M Meg is Jill's new leave. Yeah, I'm trying to think. Yes, needs to go. Ah, Aaron, you need to get up there. Oh, I forgot I should have shown that, but oh well, we'll show it later. They don't really matter. They don't really matter. Like that. We'll go here. Yeah, Adam, this is exciting, isn't it? Um, Laura, we haven't really done anything yet. That's, it's still exciting, we have no music! Woof! Oh, okay, you need that spot. And wait, and Volo, you're good there. And take up the rear. Right! Just chill. Here they come. Here they come. Yeah. The impregnable white wall! <laughs> Hello. There's part of the fun reinforcements. Fun reinforcements! Yes! Peg knights! The good news is they wield steel lances, so which have... weigh them down a ton. And also because we have the new and improved Jill, she can one round these suckers. These guys up here, this one this one has a steel ops seal stored. This one gives you a hammer if you kill him for it. Um, they're kind of a tough bunch. Let's see here. I didn't quite place Z-Hark where I wanted him. Well, we have Vogel gun here for shopping. Yes, we do. Now, we got a whole bunch of people to kill first off. Oh, it's a good idea. And let me think a second. So, let us do it like this. Mikai, you make a start. She is the general. She gets first hit. Da -da -da -da. Like this new battle music. Exciting. I could listen to it all game long. What? I thought you had this figured out. I thought I did too. <gasps> Ooh, nice. I guess we will use Meg. Good old Nolan and his awesome attack speed now. Trust in 81? Let's go for it. Trust in 81. Come on, Meg! Show him who's a Meg! You are a Meg! Meg is now a substitute for boss. Very nice, Meg. 